Good morning. I have not done my makeup or anything. Um, but today's the first day of the festival. Yay! Sarah's flight got canceled though. Um, so she won't be here till 10 o'clock tonight, which I feel really bad about. I can't take, I cannot take this camera to the festival, so every film I get from there will be on my phone, so. Let's hope for the best. I actually just really need to leave it here, because we, I, I can't lug it around all day, so. Enjoy this last little bit of 4K that you have. <laughs> um, yeah, so I need to get ready, I need to throw on makeup, and get going, so. This is the fit for today, including the boots. Ta-da! Good fit, good fit. sunburnt no red no no red no nothing uh but we saw phineas megan the stallion she was she had a very nice performance she's a very good dancer megan the stallion was good george Strait was quiet i i was far away from george Strait. Oh, so after George Strait went to miley cyrus and miley was amazing her stage presence is amazing and her voice is amazing her she is one of those singers who sounds even better in person it is crazy so the first day all right the third day the lineup for the third day of the festival fucking insane phoebe bridgers who i'd never heard of before into doja cat into billy eilish back to back to back to back to back no more <laughs> I had no idea who she was and Sarah kept saying she does very sad white girl music and before every song she would say I remember before the song that I knew she was like this is about 
lying to CPS for your parents. You know, she would say like a really sad, like, this is about alcoholism. Yeah. <laughs> so she was amazing. Uh, I love when a performer, you can tell that they have so much musicianship. Like that girl had so much. After that was Doja Cat. And I, we've been seeing Doja Cat clips on TikTok from ACL. She did so good. It was the best performance I have ever seen in my entire life. It was so good. She should have been the headliner for Saturday. She wasn't. Billie Eilish was. detail about Doja Cat. Doja Cat performed her songs metalcore. She performed Kiss Me more as a fucking metal song. It was a rock song. She had a guitarist. She had a drummer. It was the coolest shit. It was so cool. She did all of her popular songs as metal songs. It was so good because it was her song, but she was playing it differently live. It sounded better live. It was insane. I, I liked um, Billy's visuals in the background. On the big screen, she would play little bits of her music videos, like the um, My Future. My Future definitely, definitely almost made me cry. 100%. I love that song so much. I love that song so much. And she had the anime in the background. It was so good. She wore a Attack on Titans shirt. <laughs> it was really good. Um, really nice. Day two of the festival, done, over. Um, today was Doja Cat, Billie Eilish, and Phoebe Bridgers. They were all really good. I didn't know much about Phoebe Bridgers, but Sarah did, which was cool. So I got to learn more about Phoebe Bridgers and see her, which was cool. And Billie was great. Doja was my favorite. Doja was amazing. Wow. Um, Cody Ko walked by us. That was really cool. And so did Shawn Mendes walk right past us. And so did Phineas a few times. And some other TikToker that other crowd members knew. But I, I, I had no idea who it was. I had no idea. It was another TikToker, but I, I had no idea who, that, who it was. Um, and then someone else walked past us, but I can't remember who. But yeah, it was good. It was a good time. I enjoyed myself a lot. Um... Tomorrow is Tyler the Creator and Duran Duran, which will be really fun. And tomorrow is our day downtown. So downtown Austin, downtown murals and lunch and Japanese barbecue. And I'm excited. I'm going to get some good shots of that. And hang out. Have a good time. I am struggling today with feeling guilt of taking time off, which really sucks. I have a cool job that I want to do 24-7. But it's okay. It's all right. We're, we're trucking. We're going. I'm gonna go to I look I'm gonna go to sleep now. And I'll see you in the morning.
last night, night time, last night in Austin. Today was great, festival, great, downtown, great, lunch, great. Uh, I got some videos and stuff, so that's exciting. We saw Greta Van Fleet today. They were amazing. Uh, the, the, the lead singer's name is not Greta. I learned. Um, Tyler, the creator, and Duran Duran. Duran Duran was really good. I heard Girls on Film, which is all I wanted, so. Uh, and now, and now, and now. Whataburger. <laughs> Sponsor me. I got breakfast burrito. I got a breakfast burrito because, that is so loud, I'm so sorry. I got a breakfast burrito because I like breakfast. Um, and I got one a few days ago and it was so fucking good. I had to get one before we leave, so. Mmm. That was a good fucking burrito. The egg is so good. This is the best fast food egg I've ever had. Mmm. Thank you, Texas. Thank you very much. We're doing rapid COVID tests in the morning because I don't really want to go home without doing them. So we're gonna do rapid test in the morning. I've never gotten a COVID test before, so I didn't go to sleep so we can go do that. It's downtown. I'm nervous. I can already feel it in my nose hole. But yeah, I'm gonna eat the rest of this and go to sleep. I love you. We're leaving. Austin, right? Mm -hmm. Uh huh. We're but we're getting COVID tests first. But goodbye hotel room, goodbye TV. We watched a lot of South Park on. Okay, time to go get a thing shoved up our noses. landed my father picked me up we drove home and I had an awesome game night last night with my discord server and then I went to bed <laughs> and I slept so so well and my Austin City Limits t-shirt on and now I'm gonna go edit this vlog and hopefully get it out by tomorrow this was a lot of fun uh, I'm gonna be I know I'm this will be later, but I'm streaming tonight and I'm gonna talk a lot about the show and I'm excited to talk to everybody about it and talk about who my favorite people were and all that jazz, but it's good to be home. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I love doing vlogs. I, it's definitely a challenge and I think I got so much film and I really focused on it, so I'm excited to do this again someday. Even if it's just something little like a day in the park, I don't know. I just have a lot of fun doing it, so you'll see my voice is all gross from screaming, so yeah, I will see you guys later. Keep an eye out for another vlog someday, someday in the future. <laughs> Bye! Mwah. Thank you, Texas. Thank you very much.